What is going on? That's what I get to do today. I get to go play with a busted water line. Got a busted water line at my in-laws. Feeds the water to our barn. Currently my father-in-law is in surgery as I'm filming this, getting a total knee replacement. So that leaves me to go fix the water line. Stick around and I'll show you how we do it. Alright, so give you a little rundown. We've had some extremely cold temperatures for southeastern North Carolina. Been dipping down in the teens with wind chills in the single digits. I'm currently up here at my in-laws fixing to replace a water line that was busted. It supplies water to the barn for the cows and chickens and goats and whatever else he's got down there. So, North Carolina, southeastern North Carolina ain't really used to the low temps like that. We're right here on the beach. So, we're usually prepared pretty good. Insulation on pipes and whatnot, but for whatever reason, must have had a weak spot in this pipe. So, we're going to go fix it. Stay tuned. Oh, yeah. That's not good. We'll get her fixed up. Alright, so we got a main line coming out the shed, the pump. We've got the tying of here, here, and here. It looks like it just blowed apart. Weak spot. Can I help you? Boys, I think we can handle it. I might just go ahead and redo that all the way back. Just in case it's weak too. What are you doing, Maggie Moo? A little bit coming up the rear. Looks like I might have some help today. Man, look at all them collards. What you doing over there a little bit? You come to help? I'm going to reconfigure it just a little bit. I've already put a piece in there. I think I'm going to come up here and put a T and tie into these other. Come up here and put a T and tie into these other two. That way there ain't so much pressure on it the way it was before. It seemed like there was a bunch of pressure on that one line. We'll get there. Plumbing must be hard work. Maggie Moo, you laying down on the job. You don't care? You're fired. That's it. You're fired. Well, got it all fixed up. Fix and turn it back on. See if we got any leaks. I'd really like to redo this whole thing. Reconfigure it. That's going to be a springtime job. Meantime, I didn't have much help. Cow still laying down on the job. Chicken's laying down on the job. Oh, here comes the goat. Anyhow, that ain't much help. Right. We're going to give her a few minutes and turn the water back on, see if we got any leaks. Oh, no leaks. Just cut the valve on. Going to walk down to the barn. See if we can get some water flowing down there. Walk down to the barn. I can get Miss Maggie to go down there. What are you doing, girl? Huh? What are you doing, little bit? What are you doing? Are you going to get up today?
Now y'all want to follow. Oh, come on. Lord have mercy. What are you doing, little bit? Come on. Oh no, they're gonna attack us. Chickens everywhere. Let's go, girls. See if we can get y'all some water. What you talking about back there? Here comes fat ass down the coming up the rear. Oh, hush. Oh, there's a duck. Penelope. The only duck. She thinks she's a chicken. Let's see if we got water. Still got some ice in the line. What are you doing, Penelope? Why are y'all so noisy? Lord have mercy. It's a miracle we got water. We still got ice in the line. Here it comes. We'll get her flowing. Would y'all shut up? What are you talking about over there? Whoa, can I help you? I know what your fat ass wants. Lord have mercy, somebody help me. There's a special story behind this cow right here. I'll do a video on it one day. She's a mess. Puppy dog tame. Puppy dog tame. It's my wife's baby. And this thing, I don't know about this thing. All right, so we got some water back down at the barn. Cows and goats and chickens and everything else to be happy. Like I said, we've had some cold temps here we're not used to. And uh, we had everything wrapped up, but must have had a weak piece of pipe and it just blowed apart. I'm going to go back up there and re-insulate it and uh, wrap it up real good. Hopefully these 20s and teens are behind us. 
But hey, if y'all like seeing videos like this, I know it ain't much to it. How about give me a subscribe, a thumbs up, and hit that notifications button. And uh, you'll be notified when I make other videos. I get done with this piece of pipe, wrapping this pipe. I got to go put out some corn for the deer. Hopefully we can get us a deer here this evening. All right, thanks for watching, guys.